Chris, enjoying a hot cooked meal with family is something many of us count on at Thanksgiving. Two traditional holiday feasts in Fort Wayne carried on today to fill in a gap for folks who don't have food or family to celebrate with. Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Jeff Newmeyer joins us live in the studio with that story tonight. Hi, Jeff. How you doing, Tom? Fort Wayne Rescue Mission and St. Mary, Mother of God Catholic Church are beacons of hope for folks throughout the year. They extend that hope on Thanksgiving as well. St. Mary, Mother of God Catholic Church on Lafayette Street, a place where everyone is welcome on Thanksgiving. Connie Obergfell says she feels the love. What's this all about for you? Getting together. For decades, the church has cooked up turkeys, mashed potatoes, and so much other food we all crave on the holiday. First, give it honor to God for, for us to be here to, to see another Thanksgiving. And I, I appreciate these people having us now here to eat. Several days ago, volunteers started cooking to get ready for the feast, but pulling it all off involves weeks of planning and work. 750 sit-down dinners and lots of carry-out meals are served up. This woman, a first-time volunteer helping out. You need to be moving when you're here because it's kind of crowded. Good food, good people. I've seen a bunch of smiles today, including me. This is a family tradition for me. My, my mom, my dad, and two of my brothers have all worked this, so uh, it, it doesn't ever get old. Across town, another long-standing Thanksgiving Day tradition, lunchtime at the Fort Wayne Rescue Mission. The mission this day expected to put food in front of more than 3,000 people. For mission resident Daniel Hornick, the meal takes a back seat to having friends to hang out with on the holiday. It's my support system. It's, it's what's gotten me through some, uh, some pretty tough times over the last year or so. Chris Books says his family postponed their Thanksgiving to another day, partly so his daughters could serve meals to others. You know, sometimes buying them stuff is overrated, right? <laughs> um, and, and you just want them to, to have values. Being selfless, getting out of their phones, um, I think does that very well. Maybe they're estranged from their family and uh, just want a place to come and, and be a part of something. And we're, so we keep our doors open. Now, the rescue mission also provided carry-out meals for people who couldn't uh, physically get to the mission.